All right, welcome back as we take on the um, the Go Go Axum Rangers. All right. That reminds me of that old Power Rangers game on one of the games for the SNES. I never really got into those. Love the TV shows though. That was back when Power Rangers were good, not this freaking ninja space turbo jungle crap. It was just regular Power Rangers the way it was supposed to be. It was good, you know. It was. It's like when they take something and they overuse it and they'll run it into the ground. Then it just. Then it's not good anymore. But, you know. Wow, Bowser's like knocking on death's door. Enough! Now I'm angry. Ooh, it's shaking. Time to finish this. Formation, ho! Yeah, there's the Zord, if you will. Here we go. Alright, yeah, it's, now you can only attack him like, you know, attack that thing. Let's go ahead and have Peach do what she does best and heal us up. She is really, like, okay. Yeah, he's gonna fire the breaker beam. She is really a useful character to have in your party and battles like this. If a battle's gonna go on a long time or you're outnumbered, make sure you have Peach in the party. Make sure she has the lady shell and the safety ring. Wow, Bowser just got stroked. Luckily this thing has low defense. Let's go ahead and use comeback. Alright, we timed it so we got a big chunk of H- yeah, we got all of his HP back. Yeah, Peach apparently can raise the dead. She's an expert in sorcery. Alright, now Bowser's pissed. Alright, yeah, this thing's dead. This isn't possible. We are invincible. You are failures is what you are. Can this be happening to the Axe Rangers? Huh. Ooh, stomped. Alright, so we got the, uh... Got the star back. We send this thing crashing down below. It's probably gonna land in uh, Bean Valley somewhere, so it's gonna crush that casino. So yeah, it's uh, it's the great beyond's way of smiting gamblers. And there's the star, if you couldn't tell. All right, we have uh, in case your uh, your math skills aren't that great, that's six stars, which means we have one left. Six star pieces have finally been collected. Where could the last star piece be? Who knows? Alright, so we go back to Nimbus Land. And let's see here. I think it should be ready now. Dang it. I think we gotta go talk to Mallow's parents. Yeah, this. This part of the game, like we're getting ready to actually go back to Bowser's Keep. Which we had to go all the way around the world to find this thing. Yeah, here's all the statues here. Like you can see when they look at stuff. I tell you it's remarkable. Like what she says here. This statue, it's it seems so unworldly, you don't say. Don't have no see, Prince Mallow. Yeah, we already got that. Okay, here we go. Mom, Dad. Were you able to find the star, dear? Yeah, the Axum Rangers took it away from us, but we got it back again. That's wonderful. Now the star, uh, the star thing can be repaired, right? I guess not. You're still missing a piece, I take it. The last star. Wait. The only place left to look is in Bowser's Keep. Yeah, we know. But there's no way to get in. Believe me, we tried, but... Yes, yes, even Mario can't jump that far. Alright, I'll let you use the... That's it, dear. You should use the royal bus. Yes, Mallow, the time has come for you to take the bus. Why, when I was your age? Really? Are you sure it's alright? <laughs> of course, dear, I've ordered the repairman to have it fixed by the time you leave. You simply have to help Mario and the others get the last star. You bet, Mom. Come on, Mario, let's go. Alright. So now we can use ye old royal bus to bust into the keep. And yeah, we are kind of getting close to wrapping this game up, which makes me really, really sad. 
This is one of my favorite games. Probably my favorite game of all time, I'd have to say. It's a close... It's a close run between this and a few others, but... You know, it's... I'll probably just, like... If the channel gains some popularity and it ever gets big, or kinda big, and I, like, you know, reach a big milestone, I'll redo this game as, like, a milestone or something. The bus has finally been repaired. We can start operating again. Prince Mello! We want to go to Bowser's Keep. Could you give us a lift, please? Heard the story from King Nimbus. You'll be there in no time. Here it comes, here it comes! I love how it's like a, a Lakitu driving a cloud with shells for tires. So how's the engine running? Oh, it's purring like a kitten. You take Prince Mallow to the entrance of Bowser's Keep? Of course, can't wait to get this thing running again. Come on, Prince, hop on board. Alright, so we're going to Bowser's Keep. All aboard. We're off. Alright. This is what we've been waiting for. This is a pretty cool little cutscene that um, they put in here. Watch this part. When you get here, like, a lot of people you've talked to, such as Toads and the Mole people and, like, all these different people, they see you getting into the castle and they just start cheering. Yeah, see, they're like, you know, finally, it's about time, Mario. Ah, the scent of boiling lava. It's so nice to be home. Smithy's gonna pay for stealing my splendid castle from me. Alright, now for your party here, the only thing that is really, I would say, would be required, well, not required, but I would really, really suggest is to have Bowser in your party. If you have Bowser in your party during some battles here, um... It will say Bowser's scaring a monster, and they'll run away from battle. Now it could be he's scaring them because they're they're like they're ashamed that they betrayed him, or you know whatever. But still, it, it helps to have him around. For the other party member, I'm going to choose Mallow. Cause well, now let's get Gino in here. Mallow, or G Mallow and Gino are both good choices because they both have good uh, magic. I was going to use Mallow for his cheap uh, thunderbolt, but I'll use Gino so I can have magic attacks and. A really, really strong physical attack. Let's make sure I have everything equipped the way I want it. Let's see. Hmm. What's the... Eh. We'll leave the work pants on him. It's fine. Alright, I'll go ahead and fight one of these battles. See if I can make that little Bowser scaring the monsters thing register. 420, alright. Alright, it's not going to register here, but I'm sure it will later on. And we're going to fight another one, right in a row. Forkies are enraptured. Forkies are enraptured. Okay. The Forkies have come to their senses. Forky is dead. HP max, nice. Don't even think I needed it, but whatever. Alright, now. If I timed that right, I probably could have killed that thing in one shot, but whatever. Alright, so again, the enemies here are not exactly hard, even though this is one of the last hub worlds of the entire game. Well, the second to last hub world. I remember this little bridge we went over and then the, the thing collapsed and now they put the little donut blocks there. Alright, now this is, um... Yeah, this is, we're in the dark now. If you go over here, Goomba's gonna ambush you, but... Take out this Mr. Krabs first. Get out of here, Mr. Krabs. You cheap crustacean piece of crap. Take out the uh, Goomba. Yeah, it's, things got some pretty decent HP for a Goomba. And now take out the Forky. Alright, this should do it. Alright, cool. Okay, now we go over here. 
Get a, uh, I think that's a mushroom over there. Yeah, there's freaking enemies everywhere over here, so you're gonna... Let's see, let's take out Tobo Troopa. Basically the fatty, the fat face of... Yeah, see, Bowser's scaring the monsters. That's the fatty McLard face of Mario RPG. Take these clowns out, Gino, come on. Alright, that did jack crap. Bowser's scaring the monsters, so that helps. Those things have quite a bit of HP. And Bowser's scaring the monsters, so see... Having him in the party is just so handy. Alright, you go away, you jump off the edge to your doom. Alright, before we go up here, you can go behind here and there's a little secret room here. You can get coins. And a mushroom. And we'll go ahead and save our progress before we talk to Croco there. No, we don't have to fight him, we have to, uh, we don't have to, but we can buy things from him. And I'm gonna go ahead and stop. And now when we come back, we're gonna go through the, uh, the four out of six trials. So, thanks for watching. See you next time.